Today is the final day of being in Denver, Colorado. We are driving to Amarillo and your boy is back in Texas. I guess her phone died or her phone didn't have any service and I was yo I, I probably called her like 10 times yo like 10 times like yo what's going on because she had called me we went through like a little tough area and um it was like I showed y'all like you couldn't bro it was weird yo it was like a trans of snow and I couldn't couldn't see the ground and she was going through it too she, she was on like 20 miles per hour for like a good you know 30 45 minutes like it was we just we, we've been through a hell of a lot of weather changes on this trip leaving colorado but we are finally out of colorado we are in new mexico actually raton we're in raton i parked at a mcdonald's i don't know if you guys can see i parked at a mcdonald's and um waiting on her i had to uh send her my location and uh yeah there she is. Her and her uh, horrible phone service. Oh my gosh, this ride is so scary. <laughs> it's so bad. I was driving like 10 miles per hour. I wanted to cry. I literally was almost crying. It was that bad. You should have just pulled over. I told you. I, I couldn't, couldn't pull over. Like, I couldn't see anything. Like, I didn't even know where the side of the road was. I didn't either. I was like, yo, it was coming so weird the snow or whatever it was, it was like somebody like, had like that silly string and just, and just in your face <laughs> <laughs> yeah, couldn't see shit it was like the road was so bad it's snowing and raining like one it was raining when i thought like it was hailing a little bit too yeah like when we left it was raining and then it started snowing and then it started like raining and snow it was a mess i don't know <laughs> swerving so i'm gonna take a little nap real quick man we got under like an hour 55 minutes left to get to amarillo she was grooving but uh yeah i need to pull over and get like a 40 minute nap or something man so yeah i'm gonna do that right now It's the wind. It's the goddamn wind. That shit is strong. We made it, baby. Look at me. I look tired as hell. I'm right here. It's a mess. We made it. We made it. We made it. to a gym. Yeah, it's called Con Contagion. Contagion. Y'all, Contagion.
All right, so there's so much to do. Like there is literally so much to do here at this gym. Like this, this would like be the, the type of gym that I would want to own 100% hands down. This for sure is like my goal type of gym to have. So, cause this is, it, it, it's great. Big turf area, amazing amounts of racks, weight, period, clean, everything's clean. You've got a little power lifting area right here. Upstairs tracks, probably like 100 to 150 meters. Um, you know, cardio and stuff upstairs, more arm stuff, more machines upstairs. Like, I'm, I'm probably just gonna have to do like upper body with a little bit of lower body today and come back and do like tomorrow, like a performance athletic type of day. Hopefully I can find somebody to film me. I wanna get a videographer or somebody out here. And uh, yeah, cause this is, and I'm about to get a haircut in a minute. I'm about to get this workout in and there's a barber shop right here. I'm about to get a haircut in. This is what I love about these benches is the ease to be able to roll that. It annoys me like using my strength and power to have to shift the bar. Now that I'm in Texas, I feel like it's a, uh, I should officially be using, you know, I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm in powerlifting country. So I'm officially using powerlifting plates, the, the calibrated plates. This is three ninety five on the bar right now. Yo, 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 we're back at the gym. I didn't get to finish training yesterday, so back here. Today is kind of like a full body apply mixers day. I'll hit some legs. Um, I'm in between shooting this little degree commercial thingy. So definitely show love on that post because it's a sponsor post. And I need my sponsor post to do good. So I gotta make my bread. So leave a comment on that post. It'll be a degree deodorant Walmart post. So I appreciate y'all, but man, just waking up this morning, man. I just can't believe I'm actually back in Texas. I, 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 like, I was just, I don't know. Yesterday, uh, I went to uh, Whataburger, man. I, like, I, I couldn't believe. I, I, I couldn't believe. I was actually driving to Whataburger. It's been so long, man. But I'm excited. Today is, um, we end up driving 
into Dallas. I want to come here and get a quick workout in. Um, and uh, not a quick workout in, I got plenty of time, but get this workout in. Babe's still in the, in the, uh, the uh, Babe is still in the room sleep. But yeah, I'm utilizing as much as I can here, get this work in, get energized, get ready. And uh, we got a five, and a what, five hour, 20 minute drive um, later today to Dallas. So yeah, but right now I'm doing some uh, banded hand cleans. So I'm gonna continue on with that, what's good? So we are about to be on the way. Let's stop and get some gas, get some food, some quick, and uh, we're on the road. Mm -hmm. 